All right, hello and welcome back to the Crossword Vlog, aka Clog, Friday edition, and I remembered to turn on Do Not Disturb edition, which is probably less than half of the editions. Um, but yeah, uh, we're still on a streak. Um, you can see some uh, cheater squares up here. Um, so yeah, in interesting grid shape, but hopefully that means that the fill is extra queen. Um, Okay, yard nautically. Um, don't know that. Word after life or sea. Life boat. I don't know if sea boat is a thing though. A uh, pale blue dot. Beseech to get glasses. Okay. Think like pretzels or peanuts. Neither of those fit, but something along those lines. Knock it off in question form. Okay. General term in a series, maybe the nth element in a series. Lifespan or C-span. One whose Work might be a piece of cake. Pastry chef. Nice. Bit of attire seldom worn with a jacket. Okay. Maybe as of. Oh, you might tell a ref to get some glasses if you disagree with their call. One in a million. I, I'm thinking like rare, rarest doesn't quite make sense, but. This could be by something. By car doesn't really make sense because Plenty of uh, places you can't reach by car. Earth-based pigment. That might be ochre. It's like a ruddy orange-red, I think. Aer lingus. Okay. Maybe something shirt, aloha shirt, makes sense, wouldn't really put a jacket on top of that. By C, that makes more sense. Maybe real and then the rare start still works. Stubble might turn into a beard. Childlike wonder, very nice. There or thereabouts could be ish. Pronoun functioning as an object, not a subject. What? <laughs> My parts of speech knowledge is not the best. Overly commercialized celebration. Okay. Like corporate something, I wouldn't fit actually. Re key a lock. That's Etsy. This might be just New York Times. This could be go dry like a river. Not safe for work. Bars. Maybe row like 
caviar sort of thing. Locusts were a plague. Rolling on the floor laughing. Nope. Spanish geographical word. Okay. Up top. Maybe like a trap? I guess all those have nets. And stay out. Could it just be Coke bottles? Or soda bottles, maybe. That could be a dual, yeah, it might actually be Coke and then CDC control, yeah. Commonplace or Coca, something like that. And then Mall, Purple Yam or Cola, there we go. <laughs> um, Nephilist, I don't know what that is. Let's eat. Uh, maybe Costa and then Coast um, is the anagram. Uh, I guess a teetotaler is someone who doesn't drink. So I guess a Nephilist is also someone who doesn't drink. Oat milk. Badge holder. Could this just be like they? Hands out, or probably them, because then meets out. Tar the reputation. Work from, maybe just sit at a desk. Maybe Dali, like the Dalai Lama, or maybe it's just Lama, because I think it's, I think Dali is spelled differently than that. Supports, probably S here. Assembly, like in school. Set sail. For the win. Okay. Maybe why do that? Not sure what that's going to be, though. Ten thousand trillion. That is quite a lot. Science communication. Oh, that's probably Nye, Bill Nye. Maybe an E here. Maybe something nuts, like salted nuts. I think this is 
some OUK thing. And maybe like a moat of dust. Oh, maybe hang time, like the amount of time you're in the air. Tune to. Can you not? There we go. I guess a bunch of ants. Hallmark holiday. Here we go. Could Ish be wrong? Could be. Maybe just Caleb and Sag and then Rare Gem. Okay. Um, it, yeah, it's probably book like books that you would read. So avid reader. Supports. Obligatide. Maybe media bias. LA Ram. Maybe Woody? Half full. Oh, uh, maybe this is L because half of the word full is the letter L. Though, yeah, and then that could be Wendy. Supports. Maybe AIDS. And I think Liana is a type of vine, and then Ives, I guess. Sure. Um, Okay, almost there. Housework. It's throwing me off as I just, oh, this is maybe L's like that. Yeah, it's like, I just can't think of any words that look like that. Housework. Oh, maybe you might put a badge on a sash. Oh, and this is whom and then laws in like House of Congress. Ooh, very nice. Um, quite fast for my standards for a Friday. Um, let's go ahead and admire the puzzle. Um, I liked it. <laughs> um, uh, despite the vague ugliness of uh, these blocks, which isn't really that bad. Um, 
you know, what you lose in these little, like, cramped corners over here, they're not even that cramped, I mean, they have two things going all the way through them, you gain in this nice, very open, uh, sort of middle section. Um, and I, I really like childlike wonder. I think that's a very nice phrase to put in a puzzle. Um, and then Hallmark Holiday is pretty good. Um, uh, Salted Nuts okay, Can You Not is good, and Hang Time is good. Um, and then this stack is also pretty solid. Um, and you also get these nice long uh, downs as well. So uh, lots of uh, fun uh, bits of fill all around. Uh, and yeah, I don't know. Um, got some blast from the past in here. Uh, I Yeah, I, I don't really have any problems with this puzzle. Number of three letter words is fairly low and um, where they are, they're not all that tired. I mean, nth, obviously, you've seen a bunch, um, and L's as well, but, uh, you know, you get for the win and stuff, and yam is nice. Oat. Um, so, yeah, overall, I would give this one a 7 out of 10. Um, quite clean fill all throughout, some good board crossing uh, entries as well. Nothing really to complain about. Very solid. Uh, it's a bit easy Friday puzzle. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.